how to export your Wix website to HTML. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you the best way possible or the most possible way ever uh, in Wix to actually export it to HTML because there is no proper way to do it. Like from Wix itself, it does not offer that option. Uh, but you can, you know, work your way around it. It's not going to be the best. It's not going to be uh, fully functional or at all, actually. Sometimes uh, it really depends on the elements that you have on your Wix website. But first, just go ahead and open up your Wix site. Click on edit site on the top right. And basically, we want to view our site here. Now, like I was saying, a lot of the stuff that are from Wix itself um, may not actually be functional anymore after you've converted to or exported to HTML. So if you want to try to place it somewhere else, it may or may not be functional. Like maybe some uh, some elements are going to be functional, some may not be functional, and yeah, you will need to just get lucky with that. So anyways, once you've opened up your editor here, we basically want to view our site. So you can just go and publish it and view your site, or you can just hover over it and click on view site. It does not really matter here. And basically, once uh, our site opens up here, you want to locate, uh, right click on your site until you find the save as. If you find the save as option, once you actually right click, you're good to go. If you don't, then just go ahead and you know hover down a little bit until you actually find it because some sections may not um, have that in them so anyways once you actually find that save as option which i already have from the home page uh, go ahead and click on that and then you can see it's going to save as html so go ahead and save that and that is all we can actually do for the time being when it comes to exporting our html from our Wix website. Now it could take a lot longer for you. Now this is just an example site that I have. You can tell by how it actually looks like, uh, but uh, doesn't really have you know too much going on. So this is why uh, it's taking a little bit of time. But maybe you, for you it's actually going to take even longer. But anyways, here's the thing: you don't have to do this for each page individually. For example, you don't want to go to this other page just to click on save as it's going to be the same. So don't go ahead and go to other pages and do them for each single page. Just go to the home page, right click, save as, and then you should have your file. Okay, so what do we actually get? You get these two files here. This is the HTML file itself. Uh, which you can open up and you can see how it's actually going to look like and you can see the things that are going to be functional and not um, and also there are going to be a few differences here i believe uh, it does look a little bit different but anyways this is the first file and then we also have the other file which is uh this one which is going to include pretty much uh, all the media all the css all of those stuff that are from the site are going to be included in this file so you are going to actually need both for them to work. Uh, so make sure you don't delete any of them. Keep both of them and use them however you want. So this is pretty much all there is to it. Hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.